11 changes you should make before trying for a baby. Have you and your partner decided to try for a baby? Find out how to get yourself ready. Actually, this is a summary of the steps we have gone through this course. First change, cut down on alcohol. Experts are not completely sure whether a small amount of alcohol is safe for a pregnant woman to drink, but large amounts binge drinking are definitely harmful. Cutting down how much you drink now will get you used to drinking less or even stopping when you become pregnant. Second change, take folic acid supplements. Folic acid can help to prevent conditions such as spina bifida in your baby. Your baby will be most at risk in the early weeks of pregnancy. So by boosting your folic acid intake now, you can be sure that your body will be ready for whenever you become pregnant. Third change, quit smoking. Smoking can be harmful to a growing baby. So it's worth trying to quit now. Trying to beat smoking cravings can be very difficult when pregnancy hormones start to rage. Try joining a smoking cessation group and check out foundations in your country for handy tips on how to cope. Fourth change, drink less caffeine. When you are pregnant, it's advisable to limit your caffeine intake to less than 200 mg a day and this is equivalent to 2 cups of instant coffee. This is because large amounts of caffeine may increase your risk of miscarriage. Try replacing caffeinated drinks with water, fruit juice or herbal teas. This will help you adjust to not having your regular caffeine fix. Fifth change, start saving money. Babies are expensive. By starting to save now, you will have a nice pot of cash ready for when your baby arrives. Sixth change, eat a balanced diet. Eating well will help to keep you healthy so that you are ready for pregnancy. Try to eat plenty of whole grains, lean protein, low fat dairy products and iron rich food every day. Eating 5 pieces of fruit and vegetables a day will also boost your health. Slice bananas into your cereal or start the day with a fruit smoothie. Seventh change, get to a healthy weight. Being underweight or overweight can affect your fertility. It can also increase your risk of complications once you are pregnant. Now is your chance to get a healthy weight with a BMI between 19 and 25. Eighth change, exercise for a strong, healthy body. You may enjoy pregnancy more if you are fit and strong to start with. If you do not exercise regularly, try to start building more activity into your daily life. Small things such as getting off the bus one stop early or always taking the stairs instead of the lift are great ways to start. Ninth change, go to a general practitioner checkup together. It takes two to make a baby, so it's a good idea to bring your partner with you for your pre-pregnancy checkup. Having your partner come will give him the opportunity to ask any questions he has about getting ready to try for a baby. He could even have a checkup too. Tenth change, opt for a different contraceptive. If you have been using long-term contraception such as an implant, IUD or IUS, but aren't quite ready to try for a baby, you may want to switch to a shorter term method. A short term method such as the mini pill or condom can be stopped whenever you are ready to try for a baby. Last and 11th change, check your vaccinations are up to date. Some infections can increase your risk of miscarriage 
or having a baby with birth defects. But many of these are preventable with vaccination. Vaccines with a live virus, such as the rubella vaccine, need to be taken one month before you start trying for a baby. So it's worth finding out if you need any vaccinations now. This was the last lecture of this course. I hope you learned a lot from this course and now you are perfectly ready for getting pregnant now. See you in another course.